Have you ever imagined a sky full of flying cars like in the Jetsons? Well, we're getting one step closer to that reality, especially in China. At Beyond Expo 2024, a company called Aerofugia showed off its AE200X01, which is a flying car capable of eVTOL or electric vertical takeoff and landing. Well, okay, the term flying car is used loosely here. This machine resembles a hybrid between a small private jet and a helicopter, and it's powered by eight propellers, four of which can tilt for forward motion. The aircraft can be configured with seats for the pilot and up to four passengers, or you can remove the passenger seats to maximize cargo space. In the beginning, like the, uh, the passenger from airport to the downtown, we can take this kind of air taxi. So air taxi is the first B2C business, first run for this kind of Evito aircraft. Then we can change into like the cargo, emergency medical uh, service in the sky. And so many scenarios can be uh, used this kind of aircraft. The main advantage of this type of electric aircraft is the reduced cost, mainly because it can tap into the electric car supply chain for its motors and batteries, which are more mainstream than conventional aircraft parts. In the future, I mean the three or two years later, we can use AE200. Just half or 13% uh, of uh, the cost of an helicopter, we can take th this kind of uh, air taxi service. To put things into perspective, a helicopter route from Shenzhen to Zhuhai takes about 15 to 20 minutes, and it costs 999 RMB. With the AE200 though, this flight can be as cheap as 300 RMB. The AE200 has a flight range of 200 to 300 kilometers on a single charge. As a bonus, Aerofugia is able to integrate a fast charging technology from electric car giant Geely, which also happens to be its mother company. It takes just 11.5 minutes to reach 80% charge, or in layman's terms, by the time you're done drinking a cup of coffee, the aircraft can fly for another 200 kilometers or so. Dr. Gore also claims that the AE200 is quieter than a helicopter, which is great for both the passengers and people on the ground. It's also safer than a helicopter, thanks to its built-in redundancies. While it still needs a human pilot for the sake of regulations, any existing pilot with fixed wing or helicopter experience can very easily control this electric aircraft. China aims to launch its Advanced Air Mobility Infrastructure by 2028 in order to boost its low-altitude economy. As such, Aerofugia is joined by the likes of Ehan and Xpen Arot in this industry, but Dr. Guo welcomes the competition. It's, uh, how to say, it's totally a deep blue market. It's very big, like the Pacific. Every company has their advantage, should take a part of a market. So we are open for any kind of a cooperation. Actually, we are maybe, perhaps we are owning company in China uh, with uh, our own origin, I mean original design technology. Also, we have a joint venture with Germany company, which called uh, Velocopter. So we are totally open for the global market. It probably won't be long before more of these futuristic flying cars take off in the city near you.